I went to high school here, so I'm an ENSS alum. I've been teaching here for just over 20 years, and I was also a student here, so it's even more special. I went here as a former student, and I wouldn't want to teach anywhere else. I love this school. I love this community. We are a close-knit school in terms of knowing who your students are, knowing who you're working with. I love my teachers. They're very approachable people. The teachers are really supportive and always willing to help you and find your way to your success. The staff are second to none. It really feels like a positive workspace. The students have a lot of opportunity here. There's a lot of different courses and a lot of different programs, whether they're going into the workplace, whether they're going to college or university. We offer music, drama. We've got a yoga class. We have an outdoor ed program, which is phenomenal. So kids go out and can camp and hike. There is so much opportunity in trades right now. I recommend trying at least one tech program in the school and seeing if you enjoy it, because they are really good programs here. The transportation and woodworking uh, classrooms are beneficiaries of significant upgrades over the last couple years. I had uh, dual credit construction, and uh, that was a really good class. We built uh, a shed. We also built some picnic tables and um, Adirondack chairs as well. Specialist High Skills Major, or SHSM, it's an opportunity for students to enhance their pathway. It allows them a bunch of certifications that you know really give them a foot in the door. We have uh, transportation, manufacturing, construction, arts and culture, environmental program, and hospitality and tourism, or as the kids commonly refer to it as culinary. Co-op gives you an opportunity to get out in the workforce and try something that you think you might want to pursue after high school. Uh, so we have students that are co-oping in uh, the trades. I'm going into electrical, so I got into Ontario Youth Apprenticeship Program. So basically they start your college experience earlier, so I start second semester of grade 12, two days a week in class, and then the other three days I'll be at work. So it's technically a co-op. It's a really awesome way to see what you like, and then sometimes it confirms that you don't like it. And that's as valuable, I think, as actually enjoying what you've done. In our math classrooms, we don't just teach math. We're teaching the skills that you need to succeed. We really put a focus on collaboration. If you go into the classrooms, you'll see kids up working together. They're thinking, they're problem solving. I've got business, so our classroom is really a computer lab, and we learn how to use Word, Google, Jamboards, like a lot of programs that I hadn't used in elementary school. My favorite class is drama. Today, even, I wrote out light cues for an entire five-minute show, and I was on the stage wearing cloaks and gloves. It's a lot of hands-on. There's a lot of stuff to do in it. Every other year, we run our, our musicals from miles away. People show up and, and come to the musical, and the kids just love preparing for it and performing for, uh, for all their family and friends. We have school visits for grade eights to come. We do a grade nine orientation day at the end of the summer. So they get to come in, they get to meet uh, other students, they get to meet their teachers before the very first day of school. We have a buddies and mentors program, it's called BAM, where senior students do the grade nine orientation day on the first Friday after we've been here all week and it's fun games and there's a barbecue. We went out to the track and there was like dancing and singing and uh, if we just kind of got to learn a little bit more about the school than we would have known without that. Getting involved is the number one thing any staff member would tell any grade 8 student coming into grade 9. It's the best way they're going to feel comfortable. It's the best way that they're going to capture that school spirit. There's a variety of varsity sports teams, badminton, cross country, track and field, curling, rugby. We started hockey and volleyball and basketball. So I coach golf, I coach the tennis team. In terms of clubs, we've got things like an art club, we have a science club, we have a GSA group. There's so much for students to get involved in. When I was doing track and field and hockey and all the different kind of sports like that and drama and the different clubs and stuff, you kind of start to meet new people and then after you meet those new people then you start hanging out with their friends too. I think the hardest thing to do for anything in life is to just show up. So if there's any opportunity, any club, any sports activity that you're even a little bit interested in, go out to that meeting. ENSS over the decades have raised over a million dollars for Terry Fox. Betty Fox dedicated our gymnasium. We are on Terry Fox Drive. I walk into school every day through our Terry Fox doors into our Terry Fox foyer and it just is really a big part of our school and just really brings everybody together. My kids both attended this school. My niece and nephew have attended this school. All of them really loved the family feel. We're working for the students. We're working with them to meet their potential and, and exceed their potential. Get involved with whatever you can, make new friends and just have fun.